matchup zone again. It looks like Ohio State's in the zone when Lavender's in the game. Xavier getting good looks at the basket. They just can't convert. Jump hook, Oden rattles home. And that's one reason why Ohio State won't stick. Oden does a great job getting position inside. And then you can't double team if he's going to shoot that jump hook. The amount of space. Watch over here on this side of the court. Just two players. Butler throws the ball inside to Oden. And watch how he moves. He moves away from the play so he can get the pass back. And the man can't recover quickly. And he gets a wide open three. So Greg Oden will take a blow to Williger. Now Oden inside. Turn around. Jump shot. No good. But he's fouled on the play. If you're going to double team Odin or any other big guy, Gus, you got to get there before he dribbles the ball. You can't be slapping at it once the ball's in his hands after the dribble. For Greg Odin, he can use his right hand or he can use his left hand. Pretty efficient with both as he... Before August of this year, and yet he was able to do it well enough that he got to shoot 62% with his off hand. Great rotation. Nice look, Duncan, and he missed the layup. That's the presence of Greg Oden right there. He caught the ball and he was thinking, where is it? Butler from deep. Kept alive by Hunter and tapped up and in by Oden. That has to be a huge control. Steve. Now Lavender, Goldman, Burrell, Cole, Cage, Cole inside, blocked from behind. And they will tie it up. Possession arrow favoring the Buckeyes. Okay, maybe it's not a good idea to attack Odin inside. Here they try to do that. Pass inside and a very quick move by Cole. I'm sure he thought he had room, but that's why old Odin is back there in the center of that zone. Much different than he played in the first half. Goldman has a very nice mid-range jump shot. Odin, great catch, and one. And now Oden directing. Fishman catches the ball inside, goes right over Oden. You cannot play in front of Oden. That's an excellent pass inside. Now for Xavier with both Duncan and Goldman on the bench. From outside scoring power gone. Lavender leaves it inside. Rejected by Oden. And Oden comes up with the rebound. Here come the Bucks. Butler. The mighty Oden taking over. He is such a force on the inside. Now that time Lavender thought he had Odin. Odin came to him, but did you see how quickly Odin came down, turned around, blocked the shot, then he got... Butler, Odin. And one! <laughs> 11 .50 to play in the second half. Ohio State takes a 40-39 lead. Greg Odin Going to the free throw line right after this. Came out in the second half and really got his game going. Right now he's scoreless. Justin, our number one team in the South is on the ropes. We'll see what they're made of right now. Lewis, short, Oden with the rebound. And he sticks it in. There's plenty of time left. Ohio State does not need to force shot. They work the shot clock down. Pick and roll. Lavender. Stop and start. Inside. Cole. Lost it. Picked up. Conley. Leaves it for Butler. Ohio State, the number one team in the country on an 18-game winning streak. Second free throw good.